Uh, hi, my name is Eugenio. I'm half American, half Italian, and I'm currently doing the HO2 program. Um, hospitality is pretty much the only job I've ever known in my life. Since I was 14, I've been working in restaurants, and I've worked pretty much every job you could possibly have, so it was kind of a logical progression for me to continue studying that and take it into a more career-oriented kind of basis. Uh, my parents happened to move to Switzerland at the time that I was applying to university, so it was kind of convenient for me, especially because Switzerland's uh, one of the most recognized nations in the world for hospitality, and La Roche just seemed like the best fit for me. It was a mix of both practical and academic studies, and the environment's pretty intimate, and the location is pretty hard to pass up. I actually just completed a 10-month internship in Boston. I was a culinary intern working for a master chef for 10 months, and that pretty much led me to find my calling. I think I know that the culinary field is definitely where I'm going to focus the rest of my studies. Most of the stuff I learned was trial by fire. Uh, time management was huge. I think that's definitely the biggest one I learned. Uh, a lot of self-discipline. Uh, it, it sounds like a lot of cliche things, but they're just essential if you're going to survive in a kitchen because it's a pretty tough environment. And just how to kind of pace myself, how to not let myself get rattled by other people, not get rattled by pressure. It's just a lot of general knowledge type things you think would come intrinsically, but they're pretty tough to pick up on. It's interesting because it's it's an incredibly small town. It's an incredibly small, a very intimate atmosphere, which is great for making new friends because you don't really have a choice but interacting with people around you. Otherwise, I think you'd go nuts here. Um, but and I think with that you have skiing around you. You have. Geneva, you have Zurich that are two and a half hours away. I think I think the life gives you an, a lot of opportunity to make friends and do things around the area here, but also explore Switzerland at the same time without really taking up too much of your time. Um, I'm not quite sure, to be honest with you. Uh, teaching is a huge possibility. I, that's always kind of been on the back burner for me. Um, and if not that, then definitely something restaurant related, maybe a late night kind of blues bar with food that does goes into the early morning type of place. But I think that's more of a pipe dream.